Hey guys, this is Jen. Okay, so some of you have been having a few issues um, in um, Craft Edge uh, downloading scale. So let's see, let me put my name in here. And I'm going to pause this because I have to put my serial number in. Okay, so I put my serial number in. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click through this. And I'm going to get to the page where a lot of you have had problems for the Brother Scan and Cut. Okay, so it's downloading right here. Let that finish up. And then we're going to double click on that. Okay, so let's double click on this. And this tutorial is for the Brother Scan and Cut only. Okay, we'll click Run. And we're going to exit out of this or lower that. And we'll wait for it to boot itself up. Okay, so it came on. Now this came up. We're going to click and say install it. It's recommended that you close all other applications. Okay, click next. I accept the agreement. If you're ready to set it up, click next. In your program files, click next. And you can browse in there and change it if you want. I, I probably wouldn't recommend that. Okay, create a desktop icon and associate SCUT4 extension. Okay. Install. And it'll go through and install all of this. Okay. And it, sometimes it takes a while because my computer is so loaded with fonts and files. Okay. It's going through and unpacking everything. And you have to remember on our. Okay. See all this stuff? It's finished. Install driver. No, you don't want to do that. You can click launch. You can click finish. Okay. Let's try to bring this up here and see if that will. So you just exit on out. And sometimes this will come up and ask for a driver. That is not what we use with our scanning cuts. We use our little USB stick, so we don't have a driver. So you don't have to worry about it. You should just be able to click through it like always. Let's see if we can do it here. Let's see if I... Yep, it actually reset everything for me, so. This is a fresh install. But it didn't ask for a driver, which, because I already clicked through, so that's how you want to go. I should still keep my fonts in here, though. Let's see. Yep, there stands. So everybody should be in there. So, um, when you download it as you've seen just like that I just went through and click through it you don't have to worry about that okay guys so that's how you get your scale up and running all right have a good day